Hi, my name is Daniel, and in this video, I'll be introducing you to library support in Zen Studio. Zen Studio allows you to import, deploy, and consume PHP libraries used for running applications in your development environment. These libraries can be deployed on Zen Server, which also supports automatic updates of libraries. These libraries can be anything from a family of files or functions to fully structured, feature-rich frameworks, like Zen Framework, for example. To follow the steps in this tutorial, you'll need Zen Studio 10.1 or above, and Zen Server 6.1 and above. Let's get started. In my Zen Studio workspace, I've got two projects. A Zen Framework project called Hello World, and a project conspicuously called my cool library containing some code and files that I'd like to use in my Hello World project as a PHP library. The first step is to take the bunch of PHP files and deploy them as a PHP library. And to do this we need to first add application deployment support to the project containing all the code. So I'm going to right click the project in the PHP Explorer and select configure Add application deployment support. After adding deployment support, the deployment XML opens in the main editor view. In the general information area, I first need to change the project type from application to library. Then I can add some additional general info about the library. To saving my changes, in the testing area, I need to click Deploy PHP Library. In the Deploy PHP Library dialog, my Zen Server target is already defined. If you want to add a different Zen Server target, just click Add Target. What else do we have in this dialog? The library name and version already displayed. The checkbox below allows us to decide whether we'd like to add the newly deployed library to our PHP libraries list in Zen Studio. Clicking Finish, the library is deployed on the selected target. Let's open Zen Server and take a closer look. Going to the Libraries page, my cool library is listed with the other deployed PHP libraries. The library is now also listed on Zen Studio's PHP libraries list, which we can view by selecting Window, Preferences, PHP, PHP libraries. From this dialog, we can also import a package library file. All you have to do is click Import from ZPK and browse to the package library. Once imported, the library is also added to the PHP libraries list. You can also deploy a ZPK containing a packaged PHP library directly from the targets view. In the targets view, I'm going to right click my Zen server target and click deploy PHP library. In this dialog, I can either use the first option to browse to and deploy a packaged library file or deploy a library from our PHP libraries list. This list includes previously deployed libraries and Zen Studio built-in PHP libraries. So, to sum up, we've taken code, defined it as a PHP library in Zen Studio, and deployed it as a library on Zen Server. How do we now consume these libraries in our project? We simply add the library to our project's include path. To do this, right-click your project in the PHP Explorer and select Include Path, Configure Include Path. In the PHP Include Path dialog, under the Libraries tab, click Add Library. 
All we have to do now is select the libraries we want to use in our project. Now, the Add Dependency in Deployment Descriptor checkbox below means that a deployment dependency to the selected libraries will be added to our project. After we click Finish and OK to exit the Project Properties dialogs, let's take a look at our project's dependencies in the project's deployment descriptor file. We can now see that we have automatically added a dependency to our libraries. That's it for now. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any ideas for improving Zen Studio that you'd like to share with the Zen Studio team, please contact Zend. For detailed information on working with the various Zen Studio features, please visit the online documentation at www.zend.com.